brought to you by GTA, your island, your network. It's the last chance for voters to see gubernatorial candidates going at each other before Super Tuesday. It's the great debate organized by the University of Guam School of Business and Public Administration's Regional Center for Public Policy. Remember, over the years, the great debate has proven to be one of the most in-depth forums for candidates and voters. And today, a coin toss was held with campaign reps to determine which camp will answer questions first. With the tone of this election veering towards the negative, it wasn't surprising to see campaign reps choosing to answer questions last. I guess the ever-important last word is key, or in this case, the opportunity to call out your opponent on what they just said. Dean of the SBPA, Dr. Annette Santos, said she's hoping candidates will take the high road on debate night. What I'm hoping we will see at the great debates is um, a demonstration of leadership at its best, uh, where our candidates remain diplomatic and respectful. Now, just how likely a friendly chat between Lou and Josh and the Bota team is remains to be seen. Well, Santos notes, for the record, the 2018 election is definitely not the same old, same old. Different is the word for this political season. I don't think there's anything usual about what we're experiencing this political season. Something else that will be different this year at the Great Debate, members of the media will be allowed to ask the gubernatorial team's questions in one section of the debate, something the gubernatorial teams weren't too happy about. Of course. Um, you know, I think that could be disconcerting, right? You never know what the media could ask for, but I think it's, um, I think it's a great opportunity. And what about the elephant in the room? Or in this case, the donkey in the room? Was there a moment where great debate organizers thought to include the Ugin Limtiako team? And just how close to seeing a three-way debate were we? Santos saying it was definitely considered. But of course, of course, um, that question has been raised. Um, uh, the advocacy to have them involved in this process was also raised. Um, and so the students have um, made that, they've, they've tackled that um, topic and um, are sticking to the certification of the Guam Election Commission. For Guam's News Network, Chris Barnett reports. Brought to you by GTA, your island, your network.